Juanito. Let me give you a tour of my new ribbon controller. This is the hardware that controls it. It contains an Arduino, which is doing the calculations of what scale to use. Here is my smoothing circuit. It is a low pass filter, about 100 hertz. Um, so the pulse width modulation that the Arduino uses to do analog voltage out doesn't get passed through to the uh, rest of my synthesizer. Here is the, uh, here's some scaling circuitry to make sure it puts out one volt per scale. That way I can uh, keep on track with my oscillators that do one volt per octave. So it's all done, of course, point to point, for the most part, uh, with grounds going through to the uh, no focus. Grounds going through uh, to the other side of the paper. I made, well, anyway, I'll go ahead and close that up. It does, it does major, minor, pentatonic, Dorian, major seventh, minor seventh, whole notes, and uh, chromatic. So let's go ahead and turn it on and see, oh, so then I have the quantized voltage, which is these two outputs for these two ribbons right here. I have an upper and a lower. Here's two um, sides. These are from zero to 12 volts each, and that'll be useful for filters or uh, FM synthesis, things like that. Um, each a uh, long ribbon has a plain CV out, which is not processed at all. It's just about um, 1 volt to 5 volts. So that's going woo, really smooth, right? And then each long has a trigger. Each long ribbon has a trigger associated with it. So when you touch it, it goes trigger. And that way, I can trigger things like my uh, envelope controllers. So let's turn it on and hope it doesn't smoke. No smoking, that's good. I forgot to mention, under the hinged ribbon controller, I have, can you even see it? This right here is a um, force sensing resistor, which is labeled push on my module. So let's plug that in. 